Hello world, I'm an average Joe and I play games, and welcome to the finale of the No Land Beyond Challenge. This is probably the worst idea that I have ever had. I'm trying to make it entertaining for you guys, but I'm just trying to go positive at this point. Like, our expectations have gone lower and lower. And we it started out comment live commentate three games in a row only weapon i can use is no land beyond i haven't even leveled this thing this is the fourth time that i'm using it in a game um but i can use my grenades i can use my melee i can use my super but um the original plan was to lead my team and win the game any game mode in crucible and this gun is so bad that i've, I've lowered my expectation i just want to go positive that's all i want to do maybe oh firebase delphi again crying out loud um Maybe I'll just get like one kill and just hide in a corner and then just, you know, talk about the weather or something with you guys because <laughs> this is this is awful. But all right, let's see. Can we just get like a halfway decent team this time? I mean, the last two games my team has been so bad. I mean, if I don't beast, we lose by thousands and thousands and thousands of points. It is it is pitiful, and these guys are throwing their grenades and everything. I've never understood that. Like, people would do that on Call of Duty all the time. They'd spawn and they'd just, like, start shooting their gun off into the air. And I never understood that, really. So, not sure throwing the grenade. Oh, goodness. Not really sure what throwing the grenade gets you, especially on this map where B control is so key early on. You know, like, I feel like if we had that extra grenade right there, we could have could have captured B. Oh. ADS. Took, went out of ADS at the wrong time. Come on, please pop your head around. Teammate's going out. Hmm. Oh, get out, away from that. Come on. This does not have the same... I will give it to... The Call of Duty engine. That sniping in Call of Duty is so much smoother than using No Land Beyond. Like I was really expecting like a quick scope type of experience, and not at all. Like the hit detection is really bad. You can't drag scope anyone, and I am not a good sniper at all in in Call of Duty. But that's kind of what I was expecting or hoping for, and it's not that at all. So I complain about sniping a lot in Call of Duty. I did... Wow! I pulled the trigger and there's like... At least a two heartbeat delay on that that shot. Man, look at the connections this game. Can we get... Can we just get a game with good connections? That would be nice. What's going on? Where are these guys? Can we sneak up behind them? Can we do that? Ooh. Nope. Thought I had a throwing knife there. But throwing knives don't one-shot people, do they? I don't think they do. I'm gonna stay back here and just kind of pick people off as they come to be. We weren't able to do that in the first game where um, we were on Firebase Delphi because our teammates never captured B. But now that we have teammates that are, I mean... Oh, hello. Wow, my melee charge is so slow. So slow. Good job on... Oh, goodness. And then I throw the, gr the knife when I don't want to. That is one thing playing as a warlock. The warlock melee is so nice because it almost has a lock-on feature. I know non-warlocks rage against that, but it is so easy to just like turn and nail somebody with a zone A lost with a melee that you just cannot do as another another class. I need to move my point of aim higher. That's what I need to do. 
I'm used to aiming for the chest and then, like most people, aim, aim for the chest and then, oh, hello. I do not know how to survive that rocket. Nice. Don't reload there. What are you doing, Joe? I have no clue where that guy even went. Either he's lagging or I'm lagging, one of the two, because did you guys see that? He, like, disappeared. All right, so we got A and C. We just got to... They have A and C. We have B. That is A-OK. -okay. On this map, when... Hmm, trying to get my grenade off there. Respawn. All right, now it's time for the golden gun. They're still on B. See if I can. Zone A neutralized. Do not kill me. What? Zone A. I guess I have to aim this thing. I do not play Hunter very often, as you guys can tell. Hmm. Mm -mm 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 -mm. Hmm. And we are down a man. That's unfortunate. I feel like this game is winnable we can just get some help. All right, go back to controlling. Pushing B hard, which is what they should be doing. Hmm, nice nade. Nice nade. Please respawn me, thank you. Ooh, wow, what was that? Blow up, please. Blow him up, blow him up, blow him up. Nice. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. Still on B, though. Heavy ammo on the way. Hmm. Man. Heavy ammo available. He's gonna steal our heavy ammo. I feel like I'm more consistently... I probably should have trained for this challenge is really what I should have done. I shouldn't have walked into it. But um, I feel like I can consistently get one shot on him. I just need to start working on moving my point of aim up. Like most people, I aim for the chest. Oh, look! Did you see that? I don't even care that I got blown up by the grenade. That was some talent. I drilled that guy. Get ready for it. Because, you know, even though I'm complaining, I think I started to say this in my last video, but I didn't. This is one of the things that um, Destiny PvP lacks, is the lack of playstyle variety. Like, in, in Call of Duty, you have the ability to use a ton of different guns that feel completely different and you know you can you know try to be a quick scope sniper you can play knife only you can play pistol only you can play shotgun only there's a ton of different things that you can do to really um you know change your style of play you can run the riot shield with tomahawks you're on the riot shield with c4 there's all kinds of things you can do and Destiny doesn't really have that. No Land Beyond may be the um, the first real gimmicky gun. Ooh, give me those orbs. That lets you do that. That really rewards you know this you know weird odd style of play. That if you get really good at it, then you know the kills become so satisfying. Oh, we are so. So close to them. Are they flanking? Where's my radar popping up over there? Go get him, boss. Get him, boss. Nice. Nice job, boss. Gains the lead. 
just got my super. It's towards the end of the game, so we're going to use it pretty soon. Around me, through me, everywhere. These guys are everywhere. Ooh, bad. Come on, walk into that, walk into that, walk into that. Oh, you. How do you go? How do you get past that? Hmm. Mm -mm -mm. Hey, I got the assist, though. Well, I should have got the assist. I don't know why it didn't give me it. Alright, we're just gonna super because it's the end of the game. See if we can hit somebody. We did get the win, though, which is nice for once. Nope. Didn't even get to use it. Well, there you guys have it. I don't think I went positive that game. I did get a couple nice shots off. But even though I complained a lot, I... This was at, yeah, 0.56. I mean, I'm getting better. You got you got to give me that. But, um, but, yeah, look at that. We won that game because of no BZ hate. See, that's what I was saying before. You got to have, if, if somebody on your team doesn't beast, you lose the game. And that is just uh, just the way it is. Well, there you guys have it. And hope you enjoyed the No Land Beyond Challenge. You know, I, I had fun playing, you know, real gimmicky, but I feel like if you got really good at it, you could do decent, probably get around a 1.0. I don't think you're going to beast. You're not going to get 38 kills a game using the No Land Beyond. But um, I do think that you could, you know, it could become a satisfying gun um, that you could you could use. And I finally maxed out my gunslinger. Look at that. So I probably should have. Well, I haven't even leveled those up. Raining Dance Machines may be a good one to use if you're exclusively using No Land Beyond. But, alright, there you guys have it. I will stop rambling on. Subscribe, follow me on Twitter, do whatever it is you guys do. Let me know if you enjoyed this, this week's challenge. And leave a comment down in the comment section below if you have a challenge you would like to see me play. Alright, we'll see you in the next game.